Now to that dramatic rescue caught at sea. The Coast Guard saving the crew of a sinking fishing boat, lifting all four on board to safety. ABC's Tom Yamas is here with more on that story. Good morning, Tom. Amy, good morning to you. The Coast Guard had just minutes to rescue these fishermen, and when you see this video, you'll understand why. And making things even more challenging, one of those fishermen didn't know how to swim. Dramatic video of a race against time for four salmon fishermen off the coast of Alaska. One guy just went over on the starboard side. A Coast Guard helicopter launching into action, rushing to answer the mayday call of the quickly sinking 73-foot fishing vessel. We'll probably end up putting our swimmer down into the water to pick you guys up. The Coast Guard capturing these final moments as the ship began its final descent into the abyss. I've got one uh, man that's... Uh pretty old and, and can't swim. Roger that. Copy that, Captain. The pilot instructing the men below who are wearing their immersion suits, waterproof suits that protect from hypothermia, to abandon ship. Like they've got a good system going, straddling that thing for stability. A life raft is deployed at the stern, followed by this heart-stopping moment right. as one of the fishermen jumps off the boat, struggling to get in. He looks like he made it in. That's the Coast Guard's rescue swimmer now in the water. Yeah, they need to get away from that boat. Assisting the men into the raft, the fishermen then transported up to the chopper in the rescue basket. No, but coming down to about 35 feet from here. One by one, with just one man left on board, the ship is listing and has just seconds left before sinking. But the Coast Guard, whose motto is always ready, proves just that, pulling up the fourth fisherman before the sea took them like it took their boat. And this morning, all four fishermen are doing well, and it's great the Coast Guard got there when they did, George, because that water, about 40 degrees or colder, the waves, six feet high.